Hi, I'm Don Bernstick, uh, comedian, ex-male stripper. That didn't work out, so became a comedian. Uh, this is an important uh, message to uh, this whole video series for our young people. I've been in a, in a, going to our communities for over 30 years now, and I've seen fluctuations in suicide over the last 30 years. And I remember when I first heard of a suicide on my res. I'm from Alexander First Nation. And we were 12, and a, a woman shot herself with a shotgun. And me and my friends were sitting there, and we we're just trying to figure out how could somebody do that. Because nobody did that when we were younger. Nobody just killed themselves. It just was very rare. And over the years, uh, through all the trauma and the peeling back the layers of our issues as a nation, as a people, family, individuals, uh, people don't know how to deal with pain, stress, and especially in those really trying years, like when you're a teenager, uh, everything seems magnified. Loneliness is magnified. Breakups are magnified. Pain is magnified. And then as you get older, it's, it should stabilize a little bit as you mature into your life. But as an adolescent, as a young person, everything gets so magnified. And and for me, it happened. You know, for me, my, my addictions uh, and pain and breakups and stress and not dealing with pain, uh, my childhood pain, I ended up on a chair with a rope around my neck and I was gonna hang myself. And I was 20, 20 then. And I don't tell too many people that story because you know I just, I just don't. Eh? But um, I, I imagine if I would have done that, I would have just been a another statistic, a cross on the ground in my res. Uh, none of this life would have happened for me. I was very grateful that I got off that chair, took the rope off and, and looked at suicide and said, I'm not gonna do it. I don't care how much pain I'm, I'm in. I'm not going to do it. You're not going to get me. And that's kind of what I did. Is I, In the same way, I, I looked at alcohol and said, I looked at it as an enemy. I had to do it with drugs. And then with suicide, I said, you're not going to get me. And I never did it again. I never attempted again. I never thought about it again. Uh, so, and, and, and for me, I just wanted to take this moment to uh, share that experience that I had. And, uh, and I know that with his pain, I know it's loneliness and despair. I've been there. But suicide's not an option, my friends. You know? Uh, so I just want to send my love, my prayers, and we're with you. Peace.